Hey guys, welcome back to Tech World. My name is Matthew, and today I'm going to show off to you the differences between the Austral uh, Easy Fold Stretcher Bed and the Oz Tent Bunker. Now, whilst both seem quite similar, we actually have a bit of a differentiation between these because this one's polyester and this is canvas. So today, I'd like to show off to you the differences and why maybe looking towards the canvas one is the better option in the long term. Alright guys, so we've already done a proper breakdown video of this beautiful stretcher here. Uh, so make sure you go and check out that video first. But for the sake of the comparison, I'm going to give you the quick specs. So it's a full 2 meters long by 80 wide with a standing reach of 142 centimeters to the top here. Next up, we've got the bunker from Oztent. So this is a, again the same, 2 meters uh, deep by 80 centimeters wide. This one's actually taller at 145 centimetres. So I'll three centimetres taller at the top here. Doesn't actually add too much on the internal screen room, but it does give you that extra height when you're sitting up. The next benefit really is this. So it's actually got a gusseting system. So you can actually pin this out quite a bit further. If you want to have somewhere that's really quite protected when it rains, one of the most commonly asked questions we get about these bunkers is if I'm setting it up underneath my awning, which is quite common, can I set this up without the fly over the top? And absolutely you can. You see that we've got the screen on only on this one. Uh, it's got a essentially midgy proof screen here, so it's going to uh, hold up quite well, especially if you're up at the cape and surrounded by flies. It's also got three points of entry. You've got this and both sides can be opened if you want to. Alright, and now we're with the Austro one. Same system, definitely usable without the fly. Uh, you'll see that it uh, has a little bit of a lower point here, um, although it's not much lower to be honest with you. It also has the same pockets as the bunker that's in here. Alrighty guys, so I'm inside the Austro bunker now and there's a couple of key features I really want to show off to you. For starts, I'm 6 foot 3 and 120 kilos and I'm very comfortable in here. Uh, I've got room for my head and my feet aren't even touching the backboard. Um, the 150 kilo weight rating on this and it feels quite sturdy. Uh, a couple of other little nifty things they've thought about. Oztan have provided pockets on both sides here so that you can store your stuff inside. So another thing I wanted to talk about quickly while I'm in here is the, the actual uh, strips along the bottom here to help uh, distribute the weight as well as it's not rated for but there's definitely some insulation in here to sort of help with the updrafts in the morning. Alright guys, so obviously these two are very much natural competitors in the market. They both feature the same sizing, they feature the same length, they're pretty much the same height. But what you really do get with your money is with the Austin is that poly cotton ripstop canvas material. It's rated, believe it or not, to 1000 millimetres worth of waterhead, which essentially means it's going to keep water out for longer. Now this ripstop material is going to last longer than the polyester that's featured in the Austro. However, the prices are uh, considerably different to accommodate that. My personal choice would be the Austin, mainly because I treat my stuff a little bit worse than most, and I really want it to last for as long as possible. There you have it, guys. That's the major differences between the Oz Tent Bunker and the Austral Easy Fold Tent Stretcher. Both fantastic choices, both very accommodating for whatever you want to do, with the Oz Tent having slight advantages in its quality and warranty. Until next time, make sure you come on into your local Ten World to check one of these out today, or else check out one of our other videos online. Thanks guys.